All right, guys, I want to tell you all some crazy stuff right now. Real crazy. There is people that are hacking my phone right now. Some of them... God damn, I could almost just accept some of it, but... Also, I kind of see like a piece of shit for this. But... Sorry. Because there's like... Like serious like musicians all kinds of shit on my phone. I'm drunk, too, by the way. Uh... God damn, I just can't get through it. It's just too much. I'm just gonna have to get, get, get through it. There is, I, I haven't had close encounters with aliens. Okay, starting off in a field, there was a light, it, closed, it went slowly on and off, a yellow light. Then, I mean, I'm trying to get through this too fast, but then there was a, then there was another situation where I was talking to this dude and I was like, man, these, we're all high and shit. And I was like, man, these things can really, these things can really benefit uh, from us, we can measure up to them somehow. And then the next day I went underneath a toll booth and uh, as soon as I went underneath the toll booth, there was a, a big loud explosion of white over my head. This is getting, we're getting somewhere here, okay? Just hang in there. And so as, as the explosion went over my head, then, I mean, this is as I'm passing through the toll booth. Then you, then it went away faster than any, anything that, is earthbound I'm pretty sure and uh, I had a green flame coming out the back of it, it was going faster and, and within in, almost even within a second it was just out of my sight and how could it anything really move that fast you know what I mean so anyway so later on then there was another situation where uh, so then first after the first night they actually put a light show on in my mind and it was totally fucking crazy the, the guy who was there with me he's actually hacking this phone too right now because I can feel his presence. I don't need you here because I need to be looking like I'm saying when I do this. Even though I can now hear people's thoughts because of them. Anyways, I can't get through it, through this fast enough. But what I'm trying to say is that they uh, they hack they uh, they got in my brain and it caused me to see all these sights and stuff. And then whenever I and then there was this moment after I got through it with all this shit, the goddamn the goddamn. Uh, trillions of dollars and the fucking music and the goddamn everything. It was just too much for me and I was like in a state of collapse and I just hit this link about aliens hoping that they would hear me. First thing I do, I, I started walking back and forth. Got a gun on me, so. I started walking back and forth. Like something came into me, became possessed. Something came into my body. Um, and then, and then I started seeing stuff. I saw, um, there was this painting of a waterfall and I looked and I got up close to it and I saw these little dots and they were saying, Tanner, can you hear us? Tanner, can you hear us? I'm pretty sure it was actually people who were on the other side listening through my phone, wondering what the hell was going on. So anyways, uh, so anyways, after that, there was this little beam of light. You just got to bear with me because I know I'm pissing some people off right now. There was this little beam of light and it went into the painting, it exploded out into this and, it, and then when it exploded outward, it became this, it became this paradise. And, and I said, what do you, I said, what do you want me to do? You know? And it was like, Tanner, read the Bible. Think about it. I told all this to some people. And so that's where my frustration is with them. Because after I read the Bible and found out all this stuff, they took my knowledge and they used it for manipulative purposes. And that really got me down real bad. And there's been music made about that catastrophic effect that it's had on me. It was just clear. I mean, I wouldn't let this guy off the hook. I wouldn't let him go. You know, I just went on and 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 on. Didn't really explain this side of it. God damn, I need something to eat. This is just... Anyways, because... It's hard to get through this. Well, my stomach is... My brain is working so hard. Uh... But I'm just going to do this because you can see in my eyes, you know that I'm being real with you. Uh, so anyways, afterwards, this shit happened. And uh, it's so, but the point of the story was at, not long after that, I was sitting there and I was going, okay, if I focus on anchor, I'm like, my, I'm flashing out right now. I'm like having a hard time. So I'm just like, so like I need to eat right now. 
this is just working my head too hard for our, an empty stomach. I gotta get through it. <sighs> so what they did was they they got up in. I just said I, I said that I'm gonna focus on anger and see what happens. So I focused on anger, and this little ball of smoke came up in front of me. It had a whip and tail on top of it. All the rooms, all the walls of the room pressed outward at that moment. And so I go, um, I go, I was, I was like, what? And so I read the Bible and found out the vapor of smoke was in the Bible. You know, this, this is something that's supposed to happen before Jesus Christ comes back. I'm getting caught in mouth. Anyways, uh, I'm just going to power through this on cotton mouth. I'm sorry, my mouth's now that's bummed. I look all weird and shit. But anyways, uh, so, so, I go, so I go, something, so, so I read the Bible, I found out that was, and so I pretty much believed it, you know what I mean? But at this point, I've pretty much put the pieces together, and it's, this is actually a, a, um, a Trojan horse, of course, because why am I talking to aliens and all this shit happens? Think about it. That's the point of this, of this video. Think about that, okay? These aliens are putting stuff in my head to get us along this path of believing that everything is going to be okay. That's the ultimate message of the story. The last time I, t I spoke to him, I actually had a pretty vivid uh, uh, encounter with him, or whatever, the other day. And uh, I felt the presence of Jesus. Like I, I've just kind of gone over this. And I was talking to him. It was just an overpowering presence as I was talking about all this stuff uh, on Twitter about, you know, what the Bible really means, shit like this. And, uh, no, I'm just going to finish. And, and, and then, and then I went into the alien side of things and, it, and then Jesus was like, well, Tanner, you might be right about this. I don't know what the fuck is going on. And then the other day I was talking to Jesus, I swear to God. And I felt the presence of Jesus and I was talking to him and he goes, Tanner, and I, go, I, I was like, look, I just cannot reciprocate with you. And at that moment he goes, Tanner, just, you're Jesus. You're Jesus Christ. And I was walking in here, and I walked in here, and I, and I was walking in here, and, 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 this, and this feeling came over me, just saying, and it goes, and, I, and he, 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 they go, did you see me coming down there, Tanner? I go, what? And it goes, the love in your heart in every passing moment. So basically, at this point, I'm Jesus. And the whole thing about it is, is that I'm not Jesus. You know what I mean? <clears throat> I'm not Jesus. I'm not Jesus Christ. Do you see what I mean? But they've made me Jesus Christ, and you've got to ask yourself why. And the reason is is because they've got this program where the, a prophet is never welcome in his own country. First, you're a prophet who sees Jesus Christ coming. Well, if you get too powerful, you're Jesus. And I'm sorry to, to burst y'all's bubble. I know this is going to hurt some people's feelings, but that whole thing is just a really big weapon. And it's dangerous as hell, and it's scary, and... and, and uh, and man, it's bad. And 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 the things I've seen, and 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 the things I know. You know what I mean? I know for a damn fact that these motherfuckers ain't trying to make me show smoke balls and believe in the Bible and shit because they love me. You know what I'm saying? Do you see what I mean? I mean, you're gonna get confused over this, but the answer is pretty clear. They don't love. They don't love at all. They came here from a long, far ways away. And, and, and all this technology is a big threat to them. And they're looking at you like, whoa. And as much as I can feel the presence of other people and know and feel like threats and no threats and have a very, very strong reputation for it, I feel their, 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 threat, their threat low with you. And, and I understand it. Like, it's that technology. You know what I mean? You know what I mean? Like, what is that? You see what I mean? What is that thing in your hand? 